You guys, look at this. Look how beautiful it is. Beautiful. We've ran into a problem. What happened? Oh, that's a little scary. Come on, dude. Get out there. Go, Boston. This place is cold. I like got in. I got in for a quick second, like down to my legs, and it was freezing. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we are going down to this lake. It's called Tibble Fork, and we're going to just like, it's like 6.30 in the morning right now, actually. There you go, 6.30. It's so early, but we're heading down there because we want to do like an early morning, kind of like breakfast, like fun trip. So we're going to leave to that in just a little bit, but I was going to tell you guys, can you see my wisdom teeth puffiness? I feel like last night it was hurting and then it got puffy for some random reason. And I've run them out for like, I think like almost two weeks ago. So it's been like a while, but I have no idea what's going on. Anyways, let's go hop in the car and there's my alarm to see if I woke up. Stop. Let's head out and go and get some breakfast with all of our friends. Okay, we are at Original Pancake House. Met up with Kes this morning. And then, well, we, act we actually went to her house like 30 minutes ago. And we are not here at the Pancake House. I'm waiting for Taylor to come. We're gonna get some oh. pancakes, fuel up, and then we're gonna head off to Tibble. We are all here at the original Pancake House. Look who we met up with, Taylor. She's finally here. She's awake. And a little late. It's a, fine. a little late, but it's all good. Shumway Standard Time. That's how she rolls. Right? Yeah. But we are all gonna head out to Tibble Fork. We're gonna hurry and eat. I mean, we're not really on a time crunch, but we're gonna eat and then we're gonna head out. Okay, so we stopped. We got a drink from Swig. It's eight o'clock in the morning. This is probably one of the most Utah things you could ever do, but it's honestly so good. We love it. I love like soda. You don't drink soda? Oh yeah, you have a mango breeze. Yeah. It's just basically water and it's, it's mango like flavoring. Yeah, this is pretty much Starbucks, but, but Utah version. Yep. So we're drinking our drinks and we're gonna head out now. We're actually gonna head out to Tipple right now, right? I keep on telling everybody, but I guess so. are we leaving at eight o'clock? It. It's eight o'clock. I feel like we didn't plan this too well. <laughs> like we went, we were like, we went to the to the uh, to the we pancake. Eat fast. We eat in thirty minutes. Yeah. No less than thirty minutes. The food came fast. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Minutes, guys. I was probably done. I was probably done in like the first two minutes. Yeah. That's I bad. <laughs> oh well. You guys, look at this. Look how beautiful it is. Beautiful. Get it? Yep. It's so beautiful here. <laughs> Do you guys get it? View top of? It's too early. It was so funny. It was so funny. You guys just forgot to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> We've ran into a problem. What happened? Every time we turn on the blower, Kesley's How power like goes happen? off. Is your car low on power or something like that? Actually, no, it might be not... because remember when my car died? Oh, that's a little scary. Sending the music. No. <gasps> but it's been a long time since then, though. So I feel like I have enough power. Yeah. We're trying to blow up this giant unicorn and then this uh, golf cart floaty so we can go out onto the lake out here. But we did have two of our paddleboard things, but they're like little kid ones. I don't know. Well, just ask a random camper. Can we blow up our stuff? We should just <laughs> blow our leaf blowers. Leaf blowers. That, that would be so quick. Great. Yeah. I have a battery powered one. I don't know why I didn't do that. Oh, well. Shit. You guys, we freaking got it to work. We got it. You don't want to keep the car running. Just we don't want to keep their car running. We just want the battery on. Yep. Well, look at this. It's blowing up. We're going to blow up both of them and then throw them out there. Let's do it. Okay, right boss. Yep. Just send it. Oh, there's a butterfly right there. Pretty sick. <laughs> okay, go for it. Oh my gosh. It's like literally getting water in the thing. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Come on, dude. Get out there. Go, Boston. Give me a second. Yeah. This is literally sinking on me, bro. Yeah, I know. Go. <laughs> See ya. Well, there he goes. Okay, you guys, I think I might do this. I'm gonna bring one of the paddle boards and I'm gonna go over to those trees, set up a hammock so that we have that for today. Wouldn't that you be have sick? A hammock? Yeah, I have a hammock in my car. I always, I always have hammocks. That'd be sick. It'd be so sick. So, might do that. There's boss call out in the lake. I wanna come here and fish one time too, but look how sick that looks. We are now on the floaty. 
we're floating away. Our camp is just right over there, but we're not even that far out. You floating. I know, it's not even far out. Dude, this place is cold. I like got in, I got in for a quick second, like down to my legs and it was freezing. Now we're just gonna try to paddle out as far as we can. Okay, Brock and Cassie are gonna go get snow cones from Hokulia. And then me and Taylor, we're gonna go and get some fizz drinks because a drink sounds better. We'd rather have a drink. So we're gonna go get a drink, but there's Brock and Cassie. Awesome, thank you. How is the snow cone? Really good. Super good. What'd you guys get? Looks amazing. Oh, coconut ice cream's good. This place is so good. Uh -huh. We got our fizz drinks. I got like a big drink. Swig's still good, but fizz will work. I know, it's like a weird. That's so weird. Yeah. Yeah, why did they do that? I have no idea. But we were just out on the golf cart, as you guys can see out there. We would drive that thing every single day of summer 2019. Mm -hmm. Every single day, no matter what we did. We were always like, let's go drive the golf cart around. Or we would drive ours, like our blue one, that we end up getting rid of. Sad. It's kind of sad, but. That was so fun. It has bittersweet memories, right? Yeah. Okay, I've been outside working on cleaning my car and everything, but I'm about to go shower, get ready for the reception. Well, not, not reception, it's the dinner. That's where we're going to, but here we go. Okay. Check out where we are, we're in the car. I'm looking nice, I got a car shirt on. Looked pretty great. Oh, so you ready for this? So ready. So, we're, we got ready and stuff. I was actually unaware, but I have to say a little speech for my sister and Dallin, how much I love them, which I'm pretty sure they already know how much I love them, so I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. I'm kinda nervous for Kessie to watch me, but we'll see how That's it goes. gonna be so funny. But we're ready. We are heading to the wedding rehearsal thing later tonight. We're going to BYU first because every single year the cousins come, they always visit BYU. So we're gonna go over there for a quick second and then we're gonna head to the, it's called a rehearsal dinner, right? I have no idea. Or maybe it's just called a night before dinner. And my dad said it's kind of like a tradition to have like a family dinner before the wedding. So, so that's what we're gonna do. They have a pizza truck and then I think they have like maybe some other stuff that's there. But it should be super, super yummy. And we're all kind of hungry and ready to eat, but let's go. Oh yeah, look at this. Alyssa, Dallin, you guys are getting married tomorrow? Tomorrow. Oh, one that just popped. In the corner here, we have Kala. <laughs> He's just one of our good friends. We have Reese, one of my cousins. Super great, super kind, and we also have Porto here. Super awesome, really good at Fortnite. <laughs> and then we also have my girlfriend Cassie right here, super sweet, and boss my brother. Yeah. Really nice sometimes. <laughs> and then Jet, one of the smartest kids I know. There you go. Okay, they just finished up their talk. You guys, this was the best rehearsal dinner anything you could have asked for. You guys are awesome, I'm so happy. This is gonna be my new brother. Hey, it's gonna bros be awesome. for life. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. Love you guys. Love you.